everybody. It's your boy Razor Ramon the Barber. And I'm back with another fragrance review. Yeah, I appreciate y'all for tuning in to your boy. Rocking with your boy. We on the road to 300. Currently, we sitting at, I think we at 250. We at 250 right now, so we 50 away. You know what I'm saying? We're 50 piece chicken nugget away from 300. So I need y'all to do your boy a favor. Yes, Lord. You know what I need. I need you to like. I need you to share. I need you to comment. And I need you to subscribe. Yeah, man. I need you to do that for your boy so we can continue to pump out this content. I'm going to do that anyway regardless of how many subscribers I got. But I need y'all support. You know, you know what it's about. Everybody putting in work so they can get a little bit of that YouTube check. <laughs> but without any further ado, we're going to hop right into it. And I got to, you know, uh, we're going to flip it up a little bit today. It's an open tag. This goes out to everybody in Fred come. You know, my boy JP Frags, my OG down there, Trey Sense. You know, this goes out to, you know, um, Ross over there, um, TLTG. This goes out to the OG, my big bro, Big Beard B. This goes out to, you know, um, the super the super squad, you know, Smell Good General, Dedrick L. Hits. You know, this goes out to um, I Smell Mike Mike. This goes out to Jerry over there, House of Colossus. It go out to my guy over there, Twilight 2. They go out to my boy Manny. Um, and anybody else that want to hop in, man. So this is seven fragrances. Yeah, seven fragrances that you will wear to a yacht party. Yeah, man. Seven fragrances that you will wear to a yacht party. And we just going to hop right in it. And I can't forget my boy Stacks. And I'm going to tell you how I remember my boy Stacks. Because I had a nice old Rona right here. It's for you, Stacks. It's for you. Check out my boy Stacks review, man. But without further ado, so this video won't be too long, we're going to hop right into it. I thank you guys for rocking with your boy. First up, right off the rip. And yeah, I got my computer out because I, I kind of want to give you guys a, a kind of in-depth, but not so much because I don't want this video to be too long. So we're going to hop right into it. So the first one up is Bagari. Pour on Marine. Bagari Pour on Marine. And this is an amazing fragrance. I like the style of the bottle. Nice atomizer. Man, and with this, you're going to get citrus. You're going to get uh, aquatic, woozy, aromatic. Um, nice, salty. Salty, not salty like sweat, but like a nice uh, aqua uh, blue fragrance. And then this fragrance... Um, your top notes are mandarin orange, orange and uh, pomegranate. Middle notes are seaweed, um, lavender, cotton flower. And base notes are Virginia cedar, woodsy notes, patchouli, uh, sage, and amber. And I say, man, this first is this, this, this is a great fragrance for summertime, a great fragrance for spring. You know, it's airy, it's salty, it's got a little hit of um, the citrus and a little bit of the am amber on the base end kind of blends in with that citrus and it makes it a kind of, it's not a real sweet, like um, like a Paco Rabanne or something like that, but it's a nice kind of um, sweet saltiness to it. That kind of makes it um, a, a jam, man, for um, for the spring and for the summer. Or, hey, one of the fragrances that you'll wear to a yacht party. So let's keep it rocking. That is Bagari Aqua. Uh, marine, Bulgari Aqua Pro on Marine. Right on to the next one. On to the next. On, on to the next. And the next one is none other than Aqua Digio Perfume Perfumo Perfumo. That's what it is. Perfumo. Aqua Digio Perfumo. And man, this is a wonderful fragrance. Anybody? That, that boy got it. That thing got a fire hydrant on it. And man, this is a manly yet nice well-rounded fragrance, man. This is an amazing fragrance. And I don't know if you can see it, but I'll put a little dent in that thing. I don't know if you can see it, though. The juice bar right there. And um, this is a nice fragrance to wear to a yacht party, man. You're going to smell um, real invigorating, sophisticated, manly. Um, this is something that you'll wear with like a little nice little gold Rolex, you know, to a yacht party. One with the button-up shirt with the buttons open. You know, you got your, um, your, your hoochie daddy shorts on, <laughs> as they call it. 
But this is one of those nice fragrances, man. And um, this is an aromatic, marine, freshy, smoky, amber, wood, spicy. And we're going to hop into a little bit of the notes. Uh, top notes are sea notes, bergamot. And you, man, you're going to smell that bergamot in this. Middle notes are rosemary. That's that's true. Sage, geranium. Base notes are incense and patchouli. It got a little smokiness to it. But that sage and that geranium mixed with that rosemary. The flower notes in this are pretty dope, man. Excuse me. It doesn't give it like a flowery a flowery church woman flower aspect, but it adds to the adultness, manliness of this fragrance, man. It's a grown up man fragrance, you know what I mean? So, you know, it ain't like pungent as hell, but it's like when you wear this, man, you're gonna get some attention, you're gonna turn some heads. And this fragrance number two that I will wear to a yacht party. Moving on to fragrance number three. Number three, and you already know, play only live once, aka Polo Ralph Lauren. Polo Sport, and this is that 1994 straight out the rip. You know what I'm talking about? Boy, I used to love this, man, when I was coming up as a younger. <sighs> coming up as a younger, man, you had to have Polo something. You had to have a horse right here. You had to have the horse on your back, the horse on your eyes, or you had to be you had to be running around smelling something that had the horse on it. Man, and this is a classic. This is a classic. This is a classic. A must-have. Citrus, fresh, spicy. You know, aromatic, woodsy, marine, herbal. A lot of these fragrances are gonna be real aquatic. But hey, you going on the yacht party. What you expect? Um, top notes are mint, um, lavender, bergamot, mandarin, orange. You're gonna get it real. This is real citrus heavy. Mandarin, orange, lemon, neroli, um, seagrass, ginger, jasmine, geranium, man, rose. Man, you get the picture. But it's got a lot of notes in it. And then in the end, in the dry down, it has a sandalwood, cedar, and the amber. Those three notes in the dry down get us a smooth dry down. This is a real smooth and pleasant dry down, man. You ain't gonna get, you know, this is not an eight, nine hour beast. You're gonna get five, six hours out of it, but you want the yacht party. Take it with you. Most people carry a little bag or something anyway, puts it in the bag. You know, you gotta re refresh, as my boy Trace would say, hey, hit him with that pump fake. Straight, ch -ch 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 -ch, you know, refresh, come back, nobody will never know. This number three, Polo Sport by Ralph Lauren. A Ralph Lauren. Moving on to number four. Number four, number four, number four. If you're on the water, you gotta be smelling like Nautica Blue. And as you can see, I love this, man. I wore the hell out of this. This is an amazing fragrance, man. It's fruity, woody, floral. Decent atomizer on it. Um, this fragrance got a lot in it, man. It got a lot of notes in it, in the sense of not a real long list of notes, but it's a, 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 a nice range. So top notes are pineapple, bergamot, peach. Middle notes are water lily and jasmine. Base notes are sandalwood and musky and cedar. And man, this is a real smooth aquatic, man. This is a real smooth aquatic fragrance, man. Real pleasant, man. Um, you know, a lot of people give Nautica flack for the price, man, but people love Nautica. People love Nautica, man. When I was coming up, you had to have a yellow Nautica pullover, sport coat, whatever, man. Nautica was the ish, man. This is a, uh, they make a great fragrance. It's one of the reasons, uh, not because it's cheap, but this fragrance is one of the top fragrance companies in the world. You don't believe me? Do your research, man. Nautica pump out a lot of fragrances, man. And Nautica Blue used to get a lot of play, a lot of play, man. So if I'm going to a yacht party, it's definitely one of the ones you need to consider, and that's Nautica Blue. Moving on to the fifth fragrance. We're going to kind of keep this under 10 minutes. We at eight right now. Moving on to the next fragrance, uh, none other than Miami by City Rhythm. Miami by City Rhythm. That's the box. And No, that's not Miami. I apologize. San Diego. Forgive me. This San Diego by City Rhythm. San Diego. I said Miami. I'm thinking about Miami about Miami because I got to get Miami. And as you can see, it coming like this coffin style box. Uh, great, great job, Niles, by the way, man. That's my Puerto Rican brother right there. Great job, Niles, by the way. As you can see, amazing presentation. Amazing bottle. Look at the juice, man. As you can see, I wore it. I got to slow down on it, but look at the juice color, man. It's amazing, man. Amazing. Fire hydrant. Uh... And boy, boy, this right here is epic. It's twangy, it's tangy, it's amazing, it's sweet, and it comes with also a card too that has notes on it. And it's juniper berry, blood orange, heliotrope, sea salt, lavender, that's the top notes. <sighs> Ooh, excuse me. 
Middle notes on nutmeg, uh, coriander wood, almond, Moroccan jasmine, violet leaves, and iris. And base notes are beech, sea breeze, ambergris, and vanilla. And man, when I tell you this is a dope fragrance, this is a dope fragrance, man. This is a must have. If you haven't tried anything from Niles over there at City Rhythm, man, go check him out, man. He got, um, he got sample sizes. He got, um, uh, he even do Afterpay, man. You can get this, this stuff on Afterpay. Get your hands on this. I stand by anything this dude make, especially San Diego and especially Manhattan. Get your hands on it. And one of the fragrances that I would definitely wear to a yacht party will be San Diego by um, San Diego by City River. San Diego. San Diego. Get your hands on it. It's a must have. It's a must have. All right, two left, two left, two left. Um, number six is none other than Chanel Allure Sport. And shout out to my op, man, JP, man. JP gifted this to me. Appreciate you, op, for the love, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But this is an amazing fragrance. Fire hydrant. You know how Chanel do. They don't cut no corners. And this citrus, aromatic, vanilla, marine, sweet, spicy fragrance is amazing, man. So top notes are orange, C notes, Blood Mandarin, middle notes are pepper, neroli, cedar, and base notes is tonka bean, vanilla, white musk, amber, vetiver, and resin. So man, this fragrance, those bottom notes, when that tonka bean and that vanilla start laying on top of, uh, or should I say start coagulating with that blood, that blood Mandarin and that pepper, that black pepper. Oh, I can't say it's black pepper, it's a pepper. It's it gives it that twang, man, that it needs to just that extra lift, that extra punch that makes this fragrance, man, really come together. I promise you, if you cop this fragrance, you will not be disappointed. You will not be disappointed. And that Chanel Allure on Sport. And this is one of the seven fragrances that, that I will wear to a yacht party. And last but not least, last but not least, when I tell you, oh my goodness, Oh my goodness, boy, I call this the $100 Lemonade. Yes, Lord. It is Dior on Cologne. This is 2013. Boy, this is this is lemonade in a bottle. If if lemonade costs $100, this is what it'll smell like. Oh my goodness. This is manly. This is lemonade. This is peppery. This is uh, aromatic, powdery musk. But man, when I tell you, if you add this to a yacht party, boy, you gonna set it. You gonna set it off. Set it off on the left, y'all. Set it off on the right, y'all. Set it off. I'm telling you, you gonna set it off. This is an amazing fragrance. It's real simple to the point. Top notes are uh, Calabrian bergamot. Middle notes are uh, grapefruit blossom, and base notes is musk. Man, it's got like four, five notes in it, if that. But I tell you, this this fragrance is amazing. You will love this fragrance. Um, for the spring and the summer, but especially, man, if you're going to a yacht party. So, those are seven fragrances that I will wear to a yacht party. I got many more fragrances that I will wear to a yacht party, but for time and sake, we're going to have to do a part two. I thank you all for tuning in. Man, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, man. Appreciate it. And drop down in the comments below seven fragrances that you will wear to a yacht party. And if you do um content, Man, accept the challenge. This is an open challenge to frag come. I would like to know what seven fragrances with y'all wear to a yacht party. And without further ado, I'm going to end the video because it's going to be too long. It's going to take forever to upload. But I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Help your boy get to 300. As always, until next time, instant transmission.